Yo, man, hey, man, what's the word, my boy? How you feeling? Good, baby. Hey, look, I already know who the fuck I'm talking to, man. But just in case the people watching don't know, go ahead and let them know uh, who we got on camera. Trigger 600, 600, Brick City shit. For sure, most definitely, man. Hey, besides the shit that's been going on with your name been buzzing lately, man, I've been hearing about you, bro. You know, you ever heard of Reddit? Yeah. They be crazy on that bitch. You ever just typed your name in on Reddit? So just do that shit one day, bro. I don't know who the fuck them people is or where they getting this information is from, but they going crazy already, man. Yeah. And I feel like anybody who got a face in Chicago gonna forever live long through Reddit. But um, besides all that, man, I want to go back. Besides the shit that we just seen on social media, besides all the rapping shit, man, I want to go back to even before when you caught that case to exactly where you from. Because a lot of times in Chicago, people don't understand... Sometimes people don't be from that original block they claiming. Yeah, for sure. But was you 6 double O, born and raised type shit? Uh, I, ain't, I ain't come from out of 50, 60, so I came from out of 62nd, 63rd, 64. And what, King Drive? Yeah, Kaye, man. 62nd, Kaye, man. Oh, bad, bad. What's them? See, I'm from my west. Them the buildings? That was the Kaye, man, the Randolph Towers. Oh, okay, bad, bad, bad. And when, uh, when they told them motherfuckers down, you just relocated? Yeah, but it took me a while to make my way towards that way. I went and fucked with a lot of the other different blocks. You know what I'm saying? Like I had my time in the old, but it was called Wick City at the time. I was on Save Life and Burning, 66 and Lowe's, 65th and Lowe's, all through that. Okay, most definitely, most definitely. What's that? What's that? All right, bet. I know what you're talking about. Um, around what time, before we go farther into that, around what time Uh, you got book growing? How long you did? I got book in 11. I did nine and a half years. 2011? Yeah. Damn. On four, damn. On four. Yeah, for that's a that's a that's a nice little beer, bro. Okay, cool. So pretty much everything I'm finna ask you took place in 2011 or before then. Okay. So um, when they tore the buildings down, you moved, uh relocated over there on uh, 59th Calumet. Yeah. Okay, but how how was it was coming up over there? I mean, it was it was fun at the time because a lot of shit was going on. Yeah, as far as the killing and shit. For sure, for sure, most definitely. Um, and now I, I'll be asking this question, bro, because I feel like this this shit universal. It don't matter if it's west or south side, bro. And when you a shorty going up in, in in the slums and the trenches, man, motherfuckers play games like kick the crackhead, petty the shit like that, man. Point him out, yeah, point him out, knock him out, kick the crackhead. You, you you played that type of shit growing up? Yeah, I played that shit, especially even through the Met building, going over all to us burning Everhart and shit. You know what I'm saying? The time. Still fighting, and he wasn't how it is now. So he was rotating through those blocks, and the crack cares used to come from towards that way to come to the building. <laughs> yeah, for catch sure. Them, beat their ass, get their money before they come. Cause we did start getting violations for. Them. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Be for them, start beating our ass about that shit. Damn, see, look, you said violation, bro. Look, I know about that shit because I'm from the city, bro, but a lot of people only heard about that shit through Crip Mac. You know what I'm saying? All that Cali shit. Yeah. Violations, DPs. Yeah, so people was, there was some type of structure and shit when you was coming up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, my generation is like the last era for that. Okay. What generation that is? I mean, you know, I'm born in the 90s and shit, you know what I'm saying? Are you a 90s, baby? Yeah, I feel like motherfuckers that came up during that time, we like the last generation because the 2000s, baby, don't know the shit about that. For sure. No structure. Ain't nobody really trying to tell them shorties what to do. Yeah, nah. Show them ain't trying to hear shit. I'm, yeah, low key. Low, even if a motherfucker yeah, so, is. They don't. Mm, damn, low key. Pretty much for what I just took from what you just said was the shit they claiming is more than just what you claim. It's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. Like the laws and shit is the way that you should move as a man. Mm. Yeah. Damn, low key. That's that shit deep. Cause a lot of people just gang bang the gang bang. You see the other cities and shit. I ain't gonna say 
names like you feel me like I could like New York, Cali and all that different shit. Now nah, Cali go crazy. But I'm not even on no other shit. It just seemed like generations across America, when they when it kinda gang banging, they just look at that shit as like a easy way to get a name as a rapper and shit like that. Yeah. When when you see shit like that, do you like do is that something that's like respected? No, it's not respected because I feel like a lot of wars is carrying on from generation to generation. For sure. Always say, motherfucker can't say that they want to go get get back for a nigga that died years before you even came over here because you didn't even know this nigga. Most definitely. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of shit is still going on, going on without a cause. Like the cause and forgot, forgot about a long time ago. Low key. Low key if a motherfucker really think about it. But um, now I want to go back to what we just talking about. Around that age, around that age range, when motherfuckers are playing point about knock them out. That, I, I I can guess that's like what? Like around 10? 10, 10, 12? Really for sure. You know, that's true. Almost oh, 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 definitely. Because you were 90s, but you said, right? Yeah, so, but you know, when you, you, you know, in that area, it's like you grow up fast. You know what I'm saying? So, this is what the fuck was going on around us. So, you know, you, you just got them to what the fuck was going on around us. For sure. So and it was kids doing that shit. Okay, and that's why I was asking that. Because, low key, what I'll be saying now. More motherfuckers be talking about what's gonna stop Chicago violence, bro. I don't be saying this like trying to talk to the motherfuckers who thirty already, bro. It's over with. I be saying you gotta reach out to the shorties, and that could probably help some shit. But when you was around that age, go ahead. What you saying? The shorties probably couldn't even give you a direct exact answer. They don't even fucking know. They don't even know what the fuck they don't know why they doing. But what you think about trying to show them early though about like something different? You say showing them something different? Yeah. They gotta wanna see something different. Mm. The shorties don't even wanna see shit different. Damn. That's true shit. You gotta remember, us growing up, we it wasn't no internet and none of that shit like that, really. So that played a big part with what's going on. The For sure. Shit, the yeah, everybody wanna be the next Sosa, yeah. next Vaughn and shit. Yeah. You're right. But the reason I was saying that though, because around that age when you was a shorty, did you like? Did you play sports? Did you have any other outlets and shit? Basketball, but I ended up getting popped in the foot. Damn. That oh, that's a career in the injury. <laughs> Damn, so how old you was when you got shot? 15. Damn, 15? Yeah. And so that, that was just it for uh, anything athletic? Yeah. So you just, well, when that shit happened, so when that shit happened, bro, like, I don't want to, I don't want to make it seem like everybody just in Chicago, because when you, when you talk about Chicago, people automatically get to thinking like, damn, they're either aggressive, they're on some other shit, but everything you've been seeing in the media, man, with all this shit getting leaked, it's showing that Chicago is just like everywhere else, man. Yeah. For, a li- for a while, Chicago had that image, like everything untouchable. But um, at a certain age, bro, I want to say, when you say that when, when you got, after you got shot in the foot, wh- what did you do after that? Was it just like over with, like far as, as far as like your options? Mama don't even know what happened at that time, B. She, she go listen to read like, damn, that's what happened. <laughs> she don't even know, I hear that from her, B. I used to just walk around with a house shoe. You remember that? I used to just walk around with a house shoe and a sock. You know what I'm saying? She never knew, B. But, damn. Uh, yeah, no, nah, at that time, I was already in the streets. Hand, you know what I'm saying? So it just, I just went on off the floor. How you had that shit, though? Oh, and, and getting shot. Like that shit sound like it hurt for it stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had I had wrapped it up with the uh you know how you like you got the little fucked up arm, so I wrapped it up with that and I just just keep a sock on with the house shoe, with a regular shoe on this foot, and I just told him, oh, gee, I fucked my uh foot up playing basketball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Mama never knew. <laughs> Crazy, just, no Damn. Okay, now um one thing I wanna ask you, cause this shit gonna help me. Cause I, I I've been confused. They've been saying Libu, your brother. You got a few brothers. Who who are your brothers? I mean, yeah, he my brother from another mother, but for sure. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Dom, D thing, and M thing, my blood brothers. And we got another brother, Rakim. They got kids too. Besides D thing. Mm. Oh. Well, okay. And uh, they they say it was you the one who uh created Six Hundred. Who was one of your brothers? It was D thing. Actually, you know what I'm saying. I mean. It was around the same time with 600 gun line, you know, so you thought of those words, but it was D-Thing, you know what I'm saying? That was his doing. He came up with that. He, he, he came up with that name. 
and started that for that era. Now, where did that come from? Was it like on some CN 300 shit? I mean, and I ain't even talking about the people from Chicago. I mean, the movie. But, uh, you see, like, no, I don't think it's out. You know, 300 at that time, Lamar, they was, you know what I'm saying, doing their shit. So, but you know, we on 60 with King Drive. So, oh. I mean, that played a part as well. But, you know what I'm saying, 300, they was doing their time as well. I don't know what made him come up with uh, the six, 600, you know what I'm saying? But he did the shit. And everybody playing their part with getting the shit known where we're about. And before it was 600, it was Burke City, right? Yeah. Okay, now I be I be saying this shit, bro, because look, I'm from my west, bro. They, they, in the little area they call Brickyard. And that's because... Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm from over there, bro. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And then they got alleys. Them alleys full of bricks. Alleys full of bricks, man. Them alleys full of bricks all over there, bro. And that's over there out west. But is that why they... um? It was it's the same shit over there by y'all? Cause they was they, that brick city shit was what I got down. It was already four. Oh, you know for sure. Yeah. Yeah. He, he know what about the issue. Yeah. 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 Oh, it was. Oh, okay, my, yeah. my fault. Oh, for sure, most yeah. definitely. Okay. Yeah, that's for my boy, man. You know, I'm here. I'm in the cut. I'm here though. For yeah, sure. Know that. Right way, right for way. Sure, sure. Okay, now I be telling motherfuckers that for they don't believe me because they ain't never been over in that area. Yeah. I'm like, before I even seen the alley, I'm like, well, it gotta be because of that. Then I seen them bitches. That's that back in the day shit where Al Capone and them was sitting, man. Right way. I'll see motherfuckers don't even think about that. <laughs> motherfuckers don't even think about that. For you seen his crib out south? No, I didn't. He got a crib on 72nd and... In, damn, is it Palina? No, it's like Indiana. Indiana. 72nd Indiana. 72nd Indiana, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He got a crib over there. Yeah, a few of them. That's a landmark. Yeah, it's a city... Landmark shit, yeah. It's Perrier. It's Perrier. 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, 72, yeah, straight gangsters is good. For, for sure, most definitely. So now, um, with you getting booked, you said you did nine years, right? Nine, nine years, yeah. What age was that? When I get booked? Yeah. 20. You was 20? Yeah. All right, so when you got shot in the foot, that's 15. I was 15, yeah. So that's the five years of you uh, out here doing what you do. Yeah. Man, how, how was that, bro? Was it like just you finding your way? Or was it motherfuckers applying for jobs, different shit like that? Time, time. Yeah, your humble beginnings, like bro said right there. <laughs> nah, hell no, I wasn't looking for no job. <laughs> <laughs> we was outside. Right <laughs> 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 now, we saw your bag, man. <laughs> we was outside. <laughs> they said the Brits got them shooters, man. <laughs> 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 we was out here banging, man. I was not looking for no job. Yeah, no, no. What folks they were doing. For sure, most definitely. Now, um, with me talking to C Hood, uh, C Hood, the one who uh, hooked us up. Shout out, bro. Uh, one thing, one, I think, I think it was bro. I don't even want to put this on his name, but somebody was telling me, but um, before back when it was Brick City or something like that, it was actually a different uh, gang that everybody was claiming. What you mean by that? Like five GDs. Hey, 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 was over there before? Oh, you smoking five GDs? Because oh, people. Oh, oh, okay. No, even. They ever okay, before that, that we was, it's BD. That's BD. Yeah, that's that, that, okay. that, 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 that. that was A.A. That's yeah. always been a BD. That's stressed off. Got you. Because of Caddy Mac, BD. Yeah. Okay, got you. Yeah, folks never made all this. No, I be seeing uh, shit like that, though. Like, when the motherfuckers you know they talk, they put their own narrative on shit. For sure, most definitely. Yeah. Because everybody, when you really think about it with Chicago, when motherfuckers reach out and want to ask, they make it seem like if it's, if it's a BD right there, then the GD can't be in the same room. When, and then it's like you, you damn like gotta break down everything about BGD and all that other shit just to explain shit to people. Everybody got their own relationship. Who got a relationship with? You know what I'm saying? The man may be BD, but he got GDs living through that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Most definitely, most definitely. So now, um. 
when y'all was over there getting just just even six hundred started and making it a name, uh, you you was young as hell. I'm already knowing how that shit come. Yeah, I was young, and I sit back and think about the shit we was doing early on in our life. It's like but we were some bad ass kids. <laughs> <laughs> we were some bad motherfuckers. That's how I be though. You got to be like that though, man. It's it's either be eating with this shit in Chicago, yeah. in these trenches. Cause you gotta think like I, I got locked up at twenty and did all those years. So early on, on back from 20, 19, 18, 17, 15, for all them years, fourteen years old, thirteen years old, the shit that we was doing was shit that grown motherfuckers would be doing. Mm. Damn, like like what? If you can speak on it. No, I ain't gonna speak on it, but you know, for sure. shit. I got you. Say for less. Shit. Say less for sure, but um, now uh, one thing that I was thinking about when 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 it went from like Brick City to Six Hundred, yeah. was it like shit that y'all already inherited, or like what the fuck that just like even issues in the streets come from, bro? Because motherfuckers say shit like that happened over females, basketball, whatever it be. For sure. Parkway always been into it with Everhard. Most definitely, you know, gotcha. Forever, forever. Now, one thing I most definitely respect about you, bro, is I was just scrolling one day, then I seen that Squid A post, and uh, under under the post it was a, a Dusky picture, yeah. and you most definitely showed your respects. Uh, you explained how you knew him, and you, you weren't disrespectful at all. And I wouldn't say that's pushing peace, but that's just showing that before even anything happened. Motherfuckers knew each other on a uh, mutual relationship. Yeah, I, I knew Dusky, uh, uh, long as my brother Stello, he just stayed over there. So before uh, anything transpired, you know, I had my time over there fucking with them. For sure. Right way. Right way. Now, what you think about all that push and peace shit? I mean, I just feel like that. You do keep our distance. You do, you, you get your money, I'm gonna do me and get my money. We ain't gotta send shots to blink at each other, talk about each other, none of that shit. You growing up, I'm growing up. But for us, we shake hands. I mean, that's still pushing peace, what you just said, though. I mean, yeah, it is. At the end of the day. Your friend, yeah, yeah, for sure. That's still pushing peace. Yeah. Peace does grow. That's it, there you go. That, that's that's perfect. Growth, you know yeah, that's yeah, perfect. That's, that, that, that's perfect, that's man. That's my opinion. Like, I don't want to be a friend, under, but we ain't got to be out here like we was doing early in our days. You know what I'm saying? Most definitely. Most definitely. Yeah, that's growth for sure. And now, take me back, bro, to that day you got booked, man, because nine years is a long time, man. That's that's a long ass motherfucker time. That's damn near what? Damn, what's ten years? What's that? That's, that's, a, that's a, decade? a decade. Yeah, that's that's a decade. We did a decade. So take me back to that day. What happened, bro? <laughs> he said, "Shut him down." I got locked in the park with. They are they in O Block? Yeah. Right. Box us in and shit. What, what they try, uh, tried to accuse you of? Well, we got covered with other. We had different shit. Uh, I'm robbery, yeah. bad, 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 and the, and they just gave you, well, they gave you nine or something else, and nine was the fifty. They gave me twenty at fifty, baby. Bad, 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 for I sure. Getting in school and shit. Oh, oh yeah, getting jobs and little shit like that. You, you, you got a job in that motherfucker? No, I ain't getting no job. I just got in school. Yeah, that's what's up. 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 Yeah, So pretty much, if a motherfucker don't love you, you lost in that bitch. You lost. 
Lost. You can have it unless you got a mean hustle. That's one of the important things, you know what I'm saying? That's support. Like, you know, motherfuckers be nothing in there, forget about some shit like that. But I don't believe in that outside of the man shit. Because that long time I was going, it was people that was there from the beginning to the end. It's mm. just all about who you fuck with and how they fuck with you and your personnel. And you know how to fuck with a motherfucker, how they fuck with you. For sure. You know what I'm saying? Because I call it being buried alive, fuck. You know mm. No, if you was dead, who's still going to be putting flowers on your shit when you. Nine, ten years gone, for The same wow. people that's putting that money in your books, folks. Send your flowers right there. If you was in that grave. That's how I look at it, bro. For sure. Yeah, like, so now you get to a second chance of life, you know who to come on the fuck with. That's yeah, that, right, right. That's, that's where I was here. I didn't even think about no shit like that. Damn. So, um, I know you've been seeing all these county videos and shit, right? Yeah. You've been seeing that shit get leaked? Yeah. Well, who you think doing that shit? The CEOs? Uh, yeah. It, it gotta be CEOs getting a bag under the table or something. Yeah, it gotta be the CEOs. I don't know. I don't think them that getting them phones in, man. Somebody getting hit. No, no. Yeah, but them camera videos, though, like, from the wall. Them, 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 them right. CEOs, from body cam. No, no. We no. talking about, we talking about body cam. Some of them be from oh, the deck. Oh, body oh, cam. Oh, yeah. yeah. From the deck phone. Yeah, from the deck yeah, video. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Yeah, they, they releasing yeah, that shit. Yeah, that's the CEO involved in that. Hell yeah. <laughs> you, you said who? Hey, hey, guys. Uh, Darf. Who, who that is? Sheriff. Yeah. Are you the head yeah, sheriff? Yeah, he, 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 he sound like a crooked motherfucker. How much they get a person? Sandwiches? Man, no. I'm talking about the meat that that's shit. supposed to come to the joint. They yeah. be taking that shit off the truck, taking that shit home, putting it in them pickup. Fun hey, what up, you Billy motherfuckers? Wow. Say you fucking parties. <laughs> hey, I, don't, hey, I believe. I swear I believe. But was that your first case, though? No, he was not. I already did time for, uh, I was fucking around on 59th and 8th. They had the cuss block over there. So I had sure. they little diamond and shit. I did some time for that. I came home in 2011, March, and got locked up in 2011, December, and set my ass down for all them years. 